Password security is one of the most important elements in one's cybersecurity. Uh, you know, from an individual perspective and an organizational perspective, you know, pass, passwords and passphrases more specifically can be kind of that make or break point, right? So how can we make it easier to make passwords more secure? So we're gonna use password managers and we're gonna talk about what those are here in a minute. Hi everybody, welcome to StudioSec. Thank you for watching. Like if this video was helpful, comment down below with your favorite password manager. You don't have to comment that. And subscribe for more content I'm posting every week. So for, for this video, because I've been terrible uh, with this personally, but we're gonna use the term pass phrases instead of passwords. And that is the kind of heads that we want passwords to be longer, right? We want them to more closely resemble a pass phrase. So anytime I use passphrase, just know I'm talking uh, I'm talking about passwords, but longer, right? Now, passphrases are the most important element to one's security, and, and I'm you know not just discounting everything else. I'm saying that can really that might be the one of the first things that an attacker is going to go after, and for a lot of people that might be their weakest link, right? Is their passphrase. Now, ultimately, passphrase length wins the day. However, whenever you add in enough complexity to negate the risk of any kind of you know dictionary attack you know you're gonna have a pretty complex passphrase right now it's gonna be difficult especially if you're using you know best security practices and you're using different passphrases for every single account how the heck are you gonna remember all those passphrases now that's where a password manager comes in now what a password manager is is it's an app or a program that basically you only have to remember one single passphrase and that is the one to get into your password manager vault and think of it as like a vault, right? It's it's very encrypted, it's locked away, it's tucked away, and you can use it anytime you need to access an account. So it'll save the credentials and you know maybe a URL for that account, and it'll recognize, hey, you're logging into this account, well, here's your login information, log into your password manager, and I'll give it to you, right? And so you basically, you remember the, the passphrase for your password manager, it'll fill in the blanks, and, and, and that'll allow you to have very secure passphrases for all your accounts. So this way, you can set different long and complex passphrases for every single account that you have just because you have a password manager and you don't have to remember exactly what the passphrase is because it's stored in the password manager. Now, do you have to have the creativity to come up with a passphrase every single time? No, and that's one of the cool things about password managers is that they will allow is that they will help you to create a new passphrase whenever you're setting up a new account and you can determine its length, its complexity. There are all kinds of customization controls with, that come with a standard password manager uh, that make it very easy uh, to be able to have a very secure you know, set of accounts that you're using and that you know, your passphrases are gonna be very difficult for attackers trying to get in. Now mind you, these can be used on you know, an individual basis. So personally, if you're using one, great on you. That shows that you're taking security seriously, but also, you know, they can be used organizationally wide. You know, if, if you are working for a company that maybe doesn't use passphrase or password managers, then maybe this could be something you could propose as a way to improve security, right? Again, they're super easy. And think about, you know, people in your organization that for them to keep track of passphrases, they might write it down on a sticky note. Please no, right? That's not something we want them to do. But maybe they're holding like a physical ledger where they're keeping passphrases stored. Or, you know, maybe they are writing it on a sticky note. This is, I mean, just so much more secure because it's encrypted, it's sucked away. You know, attackers won't be able to get into it because the passphrase for this has to be crazy, right? You have to make sure that this one's, you know, really long and complex and difficult to, to get into. So you deploy that within your organization. Every user is using a passphrase manager. That's gonna make it so much easier for the passphrases in your company to become so much harder for an attacker to break and it's really gonna improve the security in your organization. So there are several different kinds of password managers. You're seeing some on the screen now. 
Uh, these are kind of the ones that are really mostly recommended out there. There are so many options for you. Plenty of free options out there as well. You know, you don't necessarily need to pony up money. Uh, but then again, they're not that expensive. So, you know, just, you know, skip Starbucks for a couple of days and you got yourself a password manager. Now, again, I, I highly recommend uh, that if you're watching this, that, you know, you really, you know, work to keep your passphrases secure um, and really that you know you're using you know a password manager to improve the security of your password. So you know take a look at some of those. Uh, the list that you saw on the screen is posted down below. Try to use that to you know, hopefully have some good results there. So with that, like if this video was helpful. Comment you know with what your thoughts are on password managers. If you have one that you recommend, and subscribe for more content I'm posting every week. Thank you.